then Mozi has lived here for as long as she can remember. There's not much left of the place she calls home, but like many of her neighbors, she's not surprised. Then Mozi's neighborhood in Kotapuram in coastal Tamil Nadu is in a low-lying area. It was right in the path of last week's floods. Why did the government build us a house in this low-lying area? Just to give one to those who didn't have a house. They built houses in the riverbeds and we came here. If Chemma Bara Makan Lake is opened, it will flood this place. Then where will we go? As then Mozi picks through the remains of her home, across her neighborhood, there are signs of why it wasn't able to cope. Like many Indian cities, Chennai doesn't have the capacity to deal with a crisis of this magnitude. Probably if the drainage systems were taken in line with and the two bad waters and good waters didn't mix and even the roads were properly laid up and ready for this kind of a calamity, we could have at least saved a little more damage than what is already done. Last week, coastal areas of Tamil Nadu received a month's worth of rain in just a few days. Experts say this devastation is not only the result of unexpectedly heavy rainfall, but also poor city planning. If you go and uh, study the, the flooded areas of the city, you will see most of them are either they are low-lying area or uh, you know, formerly there are lakes or marshland, wetland. So most of these areas are affected only because of this. And you know the Chennai Metropolitan Development Authority should have a should have taken enormous caution before giving them license and approvals for construction of buildings. You will see in most of these places, the areas where which I just mentioned, have got all kinds of multi-storied buildings have come up. Chennai is one of the country's most developed cities, but this flood caught authorities unaware and unprepared. These scenes of chaos and destruction are a timely reminder to the rest of India of the need to do more to prevent such disasters. So millions of people like Tenmozi can live without fear their homes will be flooded. Nididat Al Jazeera, New Delhi.